Always take a wake, kids. Always take a wake. There were like 50 Aura Logan. Where they all go? Phew. So even if I hadn't gotten awake, I would have survived, but... Thanks for messing around at Vampire Survivors 237. Beswick time. We got a horse, of course, of course. Heading over to Mount Moonspell. No evolutions. No problem. Except there'll be lots of problems. Boy, I'm actually seriously considering that. Considering what I'm grabbing. Wait. Oh. Oh, it changes the color depending on when you run. Huh, never actually did it. I was wondering why that one existed at all. Empty home. Candle Labrador. Oh, wow, that was quick. It's not a good sign, but we're going very party heavy with horse today. God, hats are so bad. Like, really incredibly bad. Also, despite everything, I still might not win with this. Horse is not great. It's party horse time. Still, greatest jubilee is greatest jubilee. It gives a good amount of damage and survivability. Make it bigger for more damage. In between that and regular old hats. Could have the option of quite some power going on. Still want to get that finisher ASAP, so better chance of getting spawn in power-ups. Like there. Pick up, pick up, pick up truck. I'm fully maxed out. Get some hats so I can get mini horse. Horses party time. Excellent. I cannot do a guitar riff for the life of me. Alright, get that lucky luck luck down there, which I've been neglecting for so long on this stage just to stick around the middle doing nothing. Oh, it's tail on four legs against these releases. Release. So many horse. You are stuck. Probably one of the better many weapons, but you were also stuck behind the worst of the main. One of the worst weapons in the game. Release plus four projectiles is good. No evolutions, no problem. That means I can just get pure level ups and go straight to limit break. Now I did have some options with my, well, second passive, in this case Can Labrador for either Rona's box or Spinage. I chose the area. Get more things. Huh, that's just keeping it decently frozen. That's a uh, go winky dink. Yeah. Here we go. No. Well, if I fail, I want some gold and eggs to make the next one easier. I mean, it's taking them out, but it's not the fastest. That's what pickups are for. The Tanuki spawn at just all the shrines, huh? Still, enough NFTs can make things different. Uh, 
British Jubilee should hit the whole screen. Otherwise, it's might for the other two. That's... that's terrible. That's bad. You got golden lost. Da -da 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 -da. Well, one more hat is always nice. I'm Orlo getting into a vacuum. And poor hats can't become like top hats. That should be the evolution. Top hats. I mean, that just makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Well, my bottom clear is going to be excellent just because everything's bouncy bouncing down there. And top clear, less so. Grace Jubilee is going to be doing all the work here. Hats will be doing nothing and party proper is waving high. It's having fun. Can't say that it's not. The Atlanteans sure went down easy. That's always a good sign. For it to be a bad sign later on, uh-oh. Oh hey, it's bouncing. Boy, I hope we get this done so that way all my limit break specific selections turns out well. Does the finisher at the bottom get bigger or is it just the central blasts? be hard to tell. I mean, the science rocks themselves didn't increase in size. It's just the blast that did. Hmm. Create a weird dead zone like this. Kill zone like that. Alright. It's NFT and we're looking into the skeleton. No. That is Farina, not you. Wow, that was quick. Oh, more party popper. Uh, it's every 20 levels, so I only have two amount, right? Yeah. So I have so much more amount coming to me. The fact that it keeps changing color means it's actually kind of hard to tell when you get hit. Especially because I was playing Holo here yesterday, since Pal World was being broken. I just threw together a whole clear stream. Had basically my largest audience ever. Hey, coincidental. Heck, had more views than most of the Vampire Survivors Beswick videos. But clearly I suggest switch to doing holo here. If all of them got you coys. Who's Mayoshi? How limited in perspective to have just one. Ah, my own Oshi. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Number one supporter of yourself. Take it to the streets. Oh, it went down. Hey. Always nice to see some duplicator amount. None of those. Gemini for party pooper. This is a choice. Does hats get the benefit of it? It shouldn't. No. I think there's another arcana that got it. Not this one, though. None of those. Three more bounces for hats, but hats is so bad. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Party Popper doesn't get beginning for some reason. Huh. No, Early Awake is an option. Not a great one, but one I basically forced myself into. 
Oh, a mount plus one. That's good. Yeah, you can really watch them fireworks fire off. That's nice. Mount's really good for it, huh? You usually get so distracted by other things and the fact that the bottom is so much more prominent that you don't notice how much greatest jubilee and is going off up to it. I have to get another amount too, so that'll be even more helpful. Maybe it's time to go full might on it. It's covering most of the screen already. Speed is probably the least thing help useful thing in the history of the world. Sweet more area or amount. I got a good amount of amount amount, eh? Why did I get speed? Big level up storm there. Well, if I'm out one, it's gonna be better than area, regardless. Mm, I'm, he's getting so much amount. That horse is showing off. Incidentally, on the subject of horses, did you know that Black Beauty was a male? The more you learn, the more you forget. Da -da -da. Man, the bottom is getting cleared out really nice. Well, I was expecting, well, I mean, it isn't a really hard place, because once we get to start tangling up, we'll get tangled up. I know, I should test out the Oni, see how they're doing. Where did it? There you are. Da -da -da -da. Mount 1 is still a Mount 1. Well, it doesn't last that long, so that's nice. Man, the party poppers are already popping off. Oh, I wasted too much NFT not fighting the Atlantean. Oh, you got it nice and close. Guess enough stuff wasn't hitting you. Maybe I should line up one of these caves or something. Keep the party poppers bouncing nice and high. Alright, let's test out the Oni, but don't go too far in. Actually, maybe this is where I want to go. I mean, it gets them all nice and concentrated. On the other hand, it's still not enough to take out the Oni. Jeez. Well, I got my max amount too. Yep. Well, come on, hat. Save the day. Well, Tango, we're going down pretty simply. Maybe I should retreat to the flower spot. They override everything else. I think I should be retreating to the flower spot more often. I just don't. Uh oh. Vacuum time. I'm out one. Yeah, yeah. Full screen is going to be nothing but great. It's really, wow, triple amount on this one. This is covering the full screen at this point. Yeah, the finisher on the bomb doesn't seem to increase in size. Oh, hey, candy box. Horses love candy. And I love skipping candy day for leg day. Which recording date is correct. It is leg day. Leg day, leg day, leg day. Yeah, the flowers interfere with the spawn of other enemies. So it makes it much safer and more profitable. They drop red gems for some reason. Yeah, I need to make a fort. 
power-ups. I can spam them in the end. Wow, talk about nothing mattering. One oh eight. Okay. Also one oh eight levels. Good grief. Dang it. Didn't want to spend all these Aura Logans. And there is another dang rosary going off. Okay, it's three Orologians right next to each other. That's nice. That's uh gonna be a lot. All right, the mini horse is also contributing the damage. They count on the weapon screen at the end. I haven't really checked. Another rosary. Lots of rosaries popping off. That's nice. And Stalker inevitably shows its ugly mug. It's two rosaries. Pretty a nice defensive fort here. Okay, what gets the most benefit for me here? Well, might as well maximize my hats. It, I can't even tell how far it reaches. I think that it's attacking so fast that it's not actually playing the correct animation because sometimes it looks like the hats are at the top of the screen. But mostly it's about up to that coin above horse's head there. 11, 12, 8. Well, the first Oni Wave doesn't do much. It's really the second one that starts getting crazy. Flowers are definitely not helping them. I can get the clovers at least. Man, I have so many levels on Greatest Jubilee. Well, oh, it's the best one of them. Man, more amount. Nice. The Greatest Jubilee has gone greater than ever before. That was not right. Speed is not helpful. Might is. Mightiest Jubilee. Oh, grabbed one of them. Boss Tengu die. Okay, very nice fort here. I think that might just be enough power-ups to get through to the end by itself. What, one, two, three, four Oralogians? That's enough. They're about 15 seconds each. Plus the Rosary. And some NFT action. Yeah, I think it's time to just go random always. I have myself a couple minutes. I suppose that's one of the major advantages of Empire Survivors. Why am I saying it like that? Why are you attacking from two different directions? That's weird. Why are you in the top, bottom right now? Uh, there's gotta be an, or an NFT in here somewhere, right? I don't even know where you are, Orochi. There you are. Give you a base full of the NFT. Crypto deserves to crash. Man, I just grabbed another dang rosary I didn't want to. Alright, Orochi went down pretty quickly to the power of the NFT and everything you were pumping out. What the heck are you doing here? He just a normal boss spawn here, and I never really consciously noticed it. Huh. Well, those should not be getting through that nonsense I have going on at the bottom. 
Alright, time for the 28 minute wave. Here we go. Right into the face. Not right away, but pretty close. Yeah, still too much. Not a good thing I have all these power ups stocked. Or pickups stocked. Well, a bit too many. A bit too early on that, at least. Chain it, chain it. Move it, break it, chain it, like it. Oh. There, there is an Orologian in there, just didn't feel like getting grabbed. Always take a wake, kids. Always take a wake. There were like 50 Orologians. Where'd they all go? Phew. So even if I hadn't gotten awake, I would have survived, but it would have endured. Greatest Jubilee doing what it does. The other two for moral support, and wow, they ended up with the exact same numbers. Now that's impressive. Horse is going to be celebrating their victory over in back country. We can't stop here. Stop here to party. Woo! Wait, there's no merch. Oh, there's a merchant. Good. You don't want no merchant. It's party popper time. Yay! I can actually play this stage semi normally again. That's helpful. These are not weapons I want. That's a passive I want. Wow, that was quick again. Alright, so this shouldn't be much trouble. Well, it is back country after all. Get that empty tome up ASAP. Good for running in front of you. Incidentally, and nothing that has to do with vampire stars really at all. I was thinking. In Holo Cure, there are modifications to your starting weapon. Each character has a unique starting weapon. Like, in stage run modification to those. One of them turns your weapon at swing backwards. You can actually directly aim there. You don't have to just do fire in the movement. You were just last, like here. But like, for pure running, that gives you some versatility if you don't want a mouse aim. Huh. Otherwise your ability to just run right and aim left generally better to have. Still. And you know it would take up one of your slots for it that you would perhaps want on something else. That increases your efficiency in saving the fans with violence. The cause of and solution to all of life's problems. I know the original quote is beer, but I always thought it was violence for some reason. Hey, it's hats time. Oh, that is not a lot of power-ups coming out of you, huh, wall? Wait. Plants? That, that means this isn't bat country. This isn't bat country at all. You lied to me. I'm gonna stop you all because of that. Bats. 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 Ouch. One more projectile. Chest. A chest. A chest indeed. And the finisher is here. And the vacuum is also here. Hats up too so I can get mini horse. Let's get them both going. 
Oh, I have all the power-ups in the world. I shown off Admiral last time. And it's exceptionally good at breaking all of these dang ends. Bye-bye, bosso. Bye-bye. Ooh. Lucky, lucky. Actually, I'm gonna go boo -boo. I'm gonna make the biggest party known to man. Biggest party known to horse, too. Look at how wacky those hats go when they got a boogaloo going. They're so random in size. It's comedy gold. And comedy yellow. And comedy pink. And comedy purple. And comedy red. And comedy blue. In every color a horse can be. Oh. Between every color. And green. And orange. And white. And other white. Actually, was white one of the base colors even in Among Us? Well, I don't think there's only one more character left on three in Waven. But not the third wave, it's I have to go back to Antonio and co-op top. I originally wanted to do it one character, one stage like that, but... Well, it's better for the tags, just put it to three characters again. That's why I switched the starter pay the thumbnails too to the newer well to this style. It's probably gonna change again for fourth wave. And what though we'll see. Oh it's back hunter I can just rain them always with no trouble. They really don't stand a chance against this much power up grabbing. Like, what are they supposed to do against this? Oh wow, there's an actual exit. I don't think I've ever actually ran long enough to find it. Now what about on the right? Yep. Finding new and exciting things about every map. Oh no, it broke. Now I am... Le Vulnerable. Horses were born in France, and only France. Hmm. You know, I never really thought about it, but horses are native to Europe. Which means they should be native to Asia, too, and they... I do know that, because Three Kingdoms. But what about Africa? It's not like you really think about the indigenous peoples there having horse access that doesn't come from old Europeo. Swayzen. Of course, no horses in the Americas. All natural vacuum. One of beavers, no horses. It's so hilarious playing Assassin's Creed 3 and just making a beaver skinning empire. Boy, did they sell for so much. Oh, yeah, I wiped out the entire wall here. Oh, even the top is getting wrecked. Woohoo! Whipped out the entire bonus side. Nice. Horse is having lots of fun. Destroying everything. Hey, there's an Arcana chest. What benefit will you bring the Arcana chest? If I could ever find you. Wow, you're far away. Wow, that's a lot of power-ups. It's also a lot of pickups, too. Hello, chest. Um. Hmm. Maybe I should go disco a gold for maximum partying. Wow, Blue Illusions look like the back of the Arcana card, too, huh? 
Man, they're not even getting in. More levels for the horse. Come on, come on. He's not that far away. Give me a last amount. Now this one should be normally pretty easy to break. Just a big old square. And you're not a square, are you? So would you them squares? And get going. Blow them up all up. Rosary time. Fifteen minutes. And it's not the end, because I know it's twenty minutes now. Totally, 100%. Believe me, believe me, believe me. Hey, I should go back to where the power-ups are. Oh, wow, I got hurt. Because crab battle. Okay, this feels just way too consistently crab battling to not be set for the stage, right? My luck can't be that consistent with getting crab battle here with random events. Ooh, wonder if I can blow it all up today. Start from a corner, then work your way around. There's the left, there's the bottom. Keep it to... This side, oh, that was this side. Wait, did more just spawn in? Oh, more just spawned in, so I can't destroy it all, huh? Uh, I must not have been noticing that, because, well, why would I? Not really something that comes up all that often. Just destroy it, trying to destroy it all. Well, I mean, it would under a less strenuous circumstances. I'm mean, hardcore noticing. Can you destroy all the bonus stage in the bonus stage? Possibly, well, this isn't a bonus stage, this is a challenge stage. The real challenge is to stay awake as you win. I am Sleepy Gus. Don't you hate it when you read something, you don't agree with it? Because, well, obviously it's wrong. And then it just gets stuck in your head. But you don't want to argue about it because it would be really pointless and dumb because you're right and they're wrong. That's my everyday. People resist the allure of facts. Oh, hey, you got frozen. Hats. Oh wow, it's like an orbit of hats. Satellite of hats. Oh no, horse. As to be expected. You know, Party Popper is doing as much or even less than hats, and yet I'd still prefer it over hats any time. Time for this party horse to head out into space, the final frontier of partying. Dun, dun, dun. Silent, old sanctuary. And my pickup is on the map, so I can go grab it ASAP. Let's... Huh. Also, I shouldn't grab it ASAP, because I have to go grab party proper. Hello, merchant. Party popper, we're partying this popper. Alrighty, eh? Raiders Jubilee up ahead of time. Best weapon that I have. Tag to busy, we solos everything. The rest of them are just there for partying. So far down. Oh, wait, I have both of these, huh? Oh, not like I have anything else to do. The sooner I grab them, the sooner I get limit breaking. And with lower levels. It's 
that means I should actually just focus entirely on the weapons. Hey, it's a duck parade. Hmm, what's a group of ducks called? I mean, I know what a group of tigers is called. It's a streak if it's a lady and her cubs, and it's an ambush if it's a bigger group. Hey, two tomes. Don't grab the tomes. I just went over this. Don't grab the tomes. From level ups. Elsewhere on the map is fine. And now I'm orange. Sweet. The weapon I would have wanted. Wait, what? Why is it doing that? that intentional? That's really strange. One more projectile. One more party to pop. I actually have that much XP on the map. Oh, huh. Now, I've never actually gone down this far. I thought it looped sooner than this. It seems it does not. And there's just no enemies on this stage. Hats. Glorious, glorious hats. Well, it's not like else there is anything to do. Yes, that is clearly a sentence a person spoke correctly. Yeah, just go south. Go south, young horse. And nothing will stop you or your greatest jubilee. Horse can't stop partying. Oh, more of them show up the deeper you go, huh? Not that that's really ever gonna happen. Hey, it's a mini horse time. Yeah, but that's maxed out, so... Yep, figures. I'm not even gonna be able to get back up there before I max out Candle Arbor. So clearly, I should banish it and get limit breaks with all of it. Yes. Now that's an idea that's really not good. Because it's not like four levels of limit breaks are gonna be the difference between victory or defeat here. In fact, it's so against victory or defeat, I'm just going to go random always the moment I get my limit break going. At least horse is fast. I mean, would you even want to play a slow horse? I've been on a slow horse before and it was not fun. It's probably dead by now, huh? That was so long ago. Back in the wayward years of yesteryear. I mean, I don't know how long a horse lives, but it really was a long time ago. And I gotta go back for the Arcana chest because it popped in at an awkward time. Alright, Starship Tour's extermination action today. When this gets posted, it'll be yesterday. Because I actually managed to get this recorded a day in advance. Yay, finally getting rid of procrastination and making sure I wake up on time. All those levels lost to Boogaloo of Illusion. That could have been doing a lot better. All the way at the end, huh? All the way at the end. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, yeah, I would want to seal the Arcana in the collection. Yes, the collection, that's what it's called. Because that way, I don't have to run into them with re-rolls. And re-rolls are very precious when you want to get a specific Arcana. And a specific weapon. And a specific passive. With everything open.
No, making okay enough time, I guess. But not an okay amount of levels. Can I just walk through yet? No, that's around 10 minutes, isn't it? When space becomes open. It's strange to think about, because space is always open. That's the very definition of space. Am I here? Yep, I'm on phaser land. And I'm a limit breaking. Let the horse party. They will probably learn. That on my last video, of course, I totally did this. Well, not this stage, but add this color scheme going. Okay. Hmm, I wonder if they have an end like the bonus. Okay, yep, once the cubes show up at like 11. Then the whole thing will get awake. Just in case, awaken your mind with glory force. Alright, so let's check if they, yep, they respawn like the bonus stages. Destroy as many as possible so I can get all of them sweet, sweet clovers. You know, the clovers don't really benefit me besides, oh wow. It's quite a lot of clovers. Wow, that was not many levels considering how much the stuff I just died there. Right. I gotta go grab that golden finger. Hmm. Oh, it's Melisa time. It means it's a bad time to get the golden finger. Um, hmm. Well, I've been completely distracted by what I wanted to say and think. As per usual. Oh, hey, it's Drowner. And no rosary to stop you. I can push you off screen and that will somehow work. Will this still hurt me? Okay, no, the bubble effect is... It's the water effect that's the dangerous one, not the bubble effect. Uh. Hey, more crates. Boxes, space boxes. You know they're from from space because they have space in their name. Where is it? Should be right on top of it. There. No, that's a hat. How many hat? Oh dang it. We would have wanted to save it for the dang golden finger. Well, actually, let me grab all these power ups so they're not in the bloody way. Pick up so they're not in the way. It's somewhere around here, maybe? There we go. That was way harder to find than it should have been. Down is probably my best option. Demon. Oh, so close to the cosmic. If I started down from the beginning, it probably would work better. That didn't give me anything. Let's see how far I can go. Whoa, square box is very dangerous. Oh well, I actually don't have the sheer raw attacking prowess to break through them all that quickly. I'm gonna be stuck here, aren't I? Well, that's quite unfortunate.
Madly enough, going up is the one that's safer than below. Strange to think about considering what's going on otherwise. Oh, and I'm released to safety in the end. Party horse, it's partied hard and won hard. Ah, a nice relaxing time away from death. Wait out. And Greatest Jubilee still does Greatest Jubilee things. Hey. Yeah, the horse has partied hard and gotten party one. 461 on Mount Moonspell. 462 over here on Bat Country. Buy that. And 463 in space. Alrighty, that takes it down to 1469 to go. Nice, nice, nice. Thanks for watching. Hope you had some fun. Thank you, anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. And if you haven't, please do so. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.